But it was it was so cool how they how we how they got me. It's like more like so we go to Phil Jackson's house. It's Mike and Scotty's there. So Phil asked me, Dennis, you want to play for me? First, first thing I said, I don't give a damn. You know, the first thing that came out of my mind, you said, okay, great, you're a bull now. So that's how, that's how we came, you know, uh, for the team. F tell me about Phil Jackson. I mean, where Ooh, good guy. Good, good, great coach, yeah, obviously. Good guy. A good guy, though. A good guy. Yeah, was it was it Daly esque? Was it Chuck Daly esque, or just different? He, he was just free. was just free. He was just free, free spirit. Like yeah, that. I mean, this is a guy who's reading like Zen yeah, and the art it. of motorcycle oh, repair, yeah. and oh. I mean, he's like a free thinker. And now oh, he was he was he, was he got the now. freest of thinkers coming to his team. It, it was cool, man, because we will sit there, lay down, and just do the Zen thing. You know, he bring people in, one is boys and stuff like that. We sit there, lay down. And get out my strike, be free and stuff like that. And that was just that's so cool because that was no one expected us. No one, I don't think anyone expected us to win 72 games. I don't think anyone expected us to win 60 games, maybe 50 games, because they didn't, they didn't think me, Michael, and Scotty would get along. You know, because how was that though? I mean, was Michael into you being no, on the team? No, he was into me because I just rebound, give him the ball. So, so I, give, I give him the ball. So, you know, right. so he, was, he was into me because they needed a rebounder. So I was also perfect fit for that team. So we got along really well though. And, and um, yeah, I get, like I said, there was no bad time in Chicago. None.